Guardians hosting the Yankees, and the Yankees are minus 138 on the money line. The Guardians are plus 118. The over-under is 8.5 runs. The Yankees laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 114, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two or more. And Cleveland getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 137, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. The Yankees won both games in a doubleheader today, 3-2 to two and 8-2. to two. As far as the weather in Cleveland tomorrow, 71 degrees, 18 mile an hour winds blowing left to right, and an 11% chance of rain. So, should be a fairly nice day. Now, to my knowledge, it was supposed to be Cortez and not Gill. And either way, if it's Gill or Cortez, neither one of them pitched against Cleveland last year, and Allen did not pitch against the Yankees last year. Head to head, the Yankees are 8 and 2. The Yankees are on a four game winning streak. The favorite has won the last two, the favorite is 8 and 2 on the money line. The favorite or the underdog getting or laying runs is 5-5. Five and five. There have been five one-run games in their last 10. The first game of the doubleheader was one of them. Cleveland made a comeback. The under is 8-2, and two, and the under 8.5 is 8-2. and two. The Yankees are 8-2 and two in their last 10. The under is 6-4 and four in their last 10. They're 3-1 and one in their last four. Five runs, seven runs, five runs, and then 10 runs. Three runs and a win, two runs and a loss, three runs and a win, and then eight runs and a win. For Cleveland... Six and four in their last ten. The over is five, four, and one. They're one and three in their last four. Twelve runs, thirteen runs, five runs, and ten runs. Five runs and a loss, seven runs and a win, and then they couldn't muster up more than two runs against the Yankees in either game today. I'm gonna to take the Yankees with the money line. I'm gonna take the Yankees laying the runs, and I'm going to lean under unless that wind goes from left to right to going out. Because if it goes out, then the Yankees bats will make them pay for it. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut. And please bet responsibly.